Cedric, welcome to West Bromwich Albion. Can you tell us a little bit about how the move came about? When did you first hear of our interest? Yeah, thank you. And uh, I think it was about a month ago. Um, my agent told me about it, you know. And the um, head of recruitment spoke to my brother as well. He found him, spoke uh, to him about me, like how he, they seeing me in the team and all of this. And uh, that's how it happened. And I had to be patient, you know, to everything goes well with Wigan, between the clubs. All went well and finally I'm here, I'm happy. What was it about this football club that attracted you? Obviously, the Premier League. But it's also a big club, you know. I remember watching them when they were in, in the Premier League before. I was still young then, because some French players were playing for the team at that time. And uh, yeah, I'm very happy to be finally a part of this club. Has it always been a dream of yours to play in the Premier League? Yeah, yeah, of course, always. My goals were to play in the Premier League by 25, and today I'm 23. And I thank God that uh, I've got the chance to play in the Premier League now. How exciting is it for you that you'll come up against some of the best strikers in the world next year? It f feels like a dream, really. You know, I'm watching them big players playing in the Champions League, playing the Prem every weekend, and thinking that I'm going to play against them. It's the very strange. I still can't believe it. This is a club, Cedric, that has been blessed with some terrific centre halves down the years. Are you a player that strives for excellence? Do you want to reach that level as well? Yeah, yeah, of course, of course, you know, and uh, I, I, I always set goals for myself, short goals, long-term goals, you know, I think it's very important for a player and yeah, when I'm on the pitch I give 100% to reach my goals, so yeah, I try to be as perfect as I can be. There's plenty of competition for places here as well in defensive areas. Are you looking forward to the challenge of trying to break into Slavin's side this year? Yeah, yeah, of course. Competition is always good, you know. It makes you it makes you better. You want to show more in training, show in games, you know. You're thinking during the game, if I don't do well, then the other guys are going to take my spot. So I have to perform when I'm on the pitch. So yeah, of course, competition is good and very important for me as well. The start to your footballing career was a fascinating one, Cedric. You were at the Paris Saint-Germain Academy. What was it like there and how much did you learn as a young lad? Yeah, it was, it was very good at PSG when I was young. You know, I've learned a lot playing with um, some very good players that are very good players now. You know, a very good club, very good academy. So I think for my, uh, for my, uh, like to start there was very, very good for me, very important. And the next stage of your development, of course, is working with a former defender himself, Slavin Bilic. How much are you expecting to learn from him? I'm expecting to learn a lot, you know, because we've played in the same position. I think um, he can teach me a lot, a lot. I've got um, a lot of uh, area to progress. And I think with um, that manager, I will, I will learn a lot. So that's good for me because I'm still young, you know, I'm 23, so it's good. Have you had a chance to meet him yet or speak to him on the phone? No, I haven't met him yet, I haven't spoke to him, but I'm looking forward to, to meet him. And what do you think of West Bromwich Albion when you played against us in, in recent years? Yeah, I've played twice, I think, uh, last season against West Brom. It was uh, two good games. We drew one, won one. It was two very good games, you know, a very good side. Obviously, they finished second, so we didn't have much of the ball, but it was a good game. And it's a four-year deal you've signed here at the Hawthorns. During that time, Cedric, what would you like to achieve at this football club? I'd like, uh, you know, we never know what can happen in football, you know. If we can stay up that season and after that we will see for other goals. Why not try to reach Europe? We never know what can happen, but we will try our best to be in the best position.